term that says set it and forget it <laughs> doesn't apply to family passcodes. Hey guys, it's Stephanie from Stephanie's Corner. Let's talk Xbox. Today we're gonna to talk about family passcodes on the 360. Occasionally, sometimes we set these up and we forget what they are, or maybe you purchased a used one from a local game shop. This is okay. Basically, what we're gonna do is head on over to account.microsoft.com. Use any email that you want to use. Once you sign in, go ahead and verify your account. Since we're gonna be making some changes and registering some stuff, let's go ahead and get that in there. Once you get here, click on devices and then click Click on add a device. Now don't worry if you're on a mobile phone, same process. Sign in, go to the little account up in the left corner, drop that arrow down and go to devices. Once you get here, you're going to see a pop-up. It's going to ask you to add an Xbox. Go ahead and click on that. And then you're going to see the option of the console. Click on that for me. And then you will be greeted with this page here. Now, once you get here, this is a setup page. What we're gonna do is click on, I can't sign into my a device. Go ahead and click on that. Then you're gonna be greeted with this page that's gonna ask you to enter your serial number. Once you click on that serial number, you will accept the terms of the privacy statement. Basically, it's just saying you're okaying the transfer. Um, if you're not sure where the serial number, there is a little link there that shows you where it's at. It's usually on the back. Once you set that up, it should show up here over to the right. You'll see that. We're gonna click on show details. If you do not see the Xbox, sometimes it takes about five or 10 minutes for it to show up. Refresh your page, try a different browser. Once you get that show details, you'll see more actions and then click on the option of reset passcode. Once you pop that in there, we should get a box that looks like this. It says reset your passcode. Steps one and two are gonna be the same for everybody. Every single person that runs this check is gonna have the same step. The last step is the four digit passcode that is unique to your Xbox. Oftentimes I see videos on YouTube where people try them and it doesn't work. Just keep in mind that the four digit passcode is unique to your system, so you have to register it. So what we're gonna talk about here, I'm gonna show you is the controller. The left trigger, right trigger, X, Y, left bumper, right bumper is gonna be right here. So left trigger, right trigger, left bumper, right bumper. And then we're gonna use the X and the Y and anything that we use for directional, like left or down, we're gonna use that directional pad. Now, in my combination, you'll see my four digit Y, Y, left down. So we're gonna do left trigger, right trigger, X, Y, left bumper, right bumper, and then we're gonna do Y, Y, left, down. Now, once you get here, it's going to uh, ask you for your combination. Don't worry if you make a mistake. Um, just become familiar with your reset passcode. Uh, obviously, this is going to take a few tries. So basically, let's head on over to your console. I want you to click on system settings all the way to the right. Click on console settings and then go down to system info. You will find that here. Once you get here, this is where you're going to see your information. Do not move. Just plug in your combination, the left trigger, right trigger. If you make a mistake, it, this will go backwards, as you can see here. Then you just go back in, redo it, and pop in the information. Now remember, if you make a mistake, back out and go back in. What you should see is a pop-up like this. Resetting your system will return everything back to factory default. Don't worry, you're not gonna lose a thing. This is just to reset the family console. And then you're gonna see the spinning logo, my favorite logo of all times. Once you click on that, then you're gonna see the next option that's gonna say press A. So once you press A, it's gonna give you the option of your language, locale, and the content controls. So just go ahead and select all that. When you get to the content controls, you want yes or no. No, I don't want it anymore, or yes, I wanna set it up again. So basically what you're gonna do is get to that part, pop it in, get your network, get it dropped in, and then it's gonna spin through. Now, this is not how fast it is on my network, it's just sped up. So once you get all that logged in, it's gonna ask you to set up a brand new account. Just click be back to go back. And then usually what I'll do is I'll just go to social and then go to sign in and you will see that I have a couple of profiles there already. So those are all my old profiles. And uh, remember that if you wanna just recheck that, just go back into your family settings. And that's it guys, you've reset your family passcode. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Hopefully you guys were able to successfully get it done. If not, remember, try again. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.